Mayweather strike you as a guy who's retiring? I don't know. I mean, he's a guy that strikes me that he... And he's a guy that doesn't really strike me. What's there a time? He, he told me once in his career that Nassim Hamed kind of tried to befriend him, and he thought at that time that Nassim was trying to keep him from fighting, that he didn't he didn't want to fight Floyd, and that was his way to it. Was there a time when Floyd kind of came to you as a stable mate and kind of tried course, to start? Of course, of course. I mean, you know, Floyd used to come to my amateur fights. I got pictures of my, I got old pictures. Did you think there was an <laughs> ulterior motive, though? I mean, I believe, you know, like I said, you know, he used to come to my older fights. He used to, where's my phone? Man, my phone. I got a picture that Julian found. After I won the National Golden Gloves, you know, he took me out to dinner, me and my whole team, and just basically let me know that they're going to be that next guy up. Was that Caesar's yeah. Palace? That was. I was out here in Vegas. I got that picture. You know? That's on my computer. Sure. You know, I think I got it. <laughs> I, sent, I sent it to you, yeah. so you should have it. You yeah, know, so I still remember that. And, and, and you know, like I say, and, and as I came up as a as a pro, I emailed it to you. Emailed it to me. Came up as a pro. Um, it was kind of the same type of deal. Oh, there it goes. That's beautiful, ain't it? This was that was dead. in Vegas. That was the 2003 Golden Gloves. Um, with the Golden Gloves, or the USA Nationals. That was yeah. the Golden Gloves. The Nationals were there, here the year before, but that was after the it Golden Gloves. Okay. That's when he took. Oh, that was all four of them. This was know, over the National Right back over. You know, just basically just showing love. Like, man, you're going to be next up. Nah, nah, this and that. So, like I said, he, he, you know, he's always, I think he's always had, um, oh, yeah, this right here. <laughs> this chapter, I don't want to go to Golden Globe. He's taking us in his Bentley, going over there. The Golden Globe Award. Yeah, and I want to go to Golden Globe. I'm going to go over there, yeah. Like I said, like I said, like I said he always had. Like to me, I think he's always had a certain type of, you know, idea that 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 may be, you know. What I mean, and and you know, from the amateurs even to the pros. I mean, like I said, he showed up a few of my, you know, early pro fights, you know, and and, and you know, and he seemed I had that demeanor that, yeah, you cool, but like I want that, what you got, like I want that. You know what I'm saying? He can kind of tell that I didn't, you know, you, you know, you're cool, but you're my type of guy, and I want everything you got. You know what I'm saying? I'm, and that's what I'm in the game for. I'm not a, you know, you know, even brother, that's my homie, but you know, I'm, I'm not one of those type of guys. You know what I mean? I, I gotta show respect, but respect is due for sure. But I'm in this game for a reason. I say we want that number one spot. Did you think he kind of wanted you to kiss the ring? <laughs> I don't care what he wanted me to do. <laughs> you know, and, it, and you know, the situation too, man, it's, 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 it's and you know, he's coming up in the pros as well. You know, I was barking it. Man, that's what I wanted. And, uh, and uh, you know, like, I had a, had a knockout. I forgot where I fought. I was supposed to be fighting him next. He threw a tease fight at me. I'm like, yo. Come on, man, let's do this. You know what I mean? And yeah, I don't know where T stopped hearing about him, but I just took that completely left. I was just upset, mad, didn't want to train like I needed to. Walk to the ring, see him, 50 Cent, all of them sitting right there front row. Damn, I should train. You know what I mean? And, and, then, and that's just what it was, but well, like I say, man, I'm, I'm, I'm just that type of dude that. That um, I mean, the only thing that I, you know, really believe in and really trust, you know, is my family because they they've been with me through the thick thing. You know, we 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 we've been through those situations where we, you know, those are the people I can depend on. I can't depend on anybody in my face smiling and you know throwing money around or blah blah blah. I don't trust that. You know what I mean? So.